You give me your ass to kiss, and I will give you mine. Stop playing with me. Period. Y'all, he really tried me. Like, he really tried me. Like, he really tried me like a weak bitch. Okay? He tried it. He tried it. I'm a cold bitch, yes. I'm a cold piece. Looking for a Mr. Freeze to get froze like me. Like a lot of cold stones, and I ain't talking ice cream. Ice my cream. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Miss KK, and I'm back with another video. This is going to be a quick little story time. I have to come in and tell y'all this story. Like, don't mind me. I'm going to get it fixed. I'm in the middle of getting my life together. But, yeah. So, I just got to my office. And I just had to give y'all a quick little story time. S let's get into it. So, let's get into the story. So, a couple of months ago. Y'all remember, if y'all don't remember, go watch my previous vlogs. Um, I got shouted out on the radio station uh, for doing a small gesture, being a kind person that I am. Um, yeah, so pushing past that, the guy, I'm going to call him, I don't know what the... I don't know what to call him. P. Let's just say P. Um, yeah, I'm calling P. So P is the DJ well, for for the radio station or whatever. And he tries to pursue, I guess, tries to get to know somebody. I don't know. But whatever the case may be, uh, he he tried to pursue like trying to get to know me or whatever got my number got my instagram and all this other stuff so he's not my typical person that i go for he's not the typical like whatever but he was okay you know uh after everything that i've been through in my life you know i'm trying to keep an open mind and um you know not judge a book by his cover Give people a chance because clearly the pe the dudes that I am attracted to automatically they full of shit. So I'm trying not. So yeah, um, that came about, and you know the communication was good, like it always is when you first start. You know it is always it's always you know whatever. So then boom, it came around for events. So his events, he was inviting me to his events. Y'all seen the other vlogs. Whatever. If y'all seen other vlogs, tell me down below that y'all know who I'm talking about. But yeah. Fast forward. We he had an event and um he was like, Yeah, you and your people pull up. Da, 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 da. Like, I'm like, I'm gonna get y'all covered, but I'm gonna get y'all covered, you know. Um, y'all can get in, we'll have a good time, get y'all some food, you know, whatever the case may be. So, the moment I told him, I tell my girls that, you know, there was food and liquor, they was ready. So, they, they didn't really care about getting in free, they just want to go and have a good time. So, we went to the events, um, we got cute, I got real subtle, got cute, y'all seen the vlog. Um, got there and first first thing I saw was him talking, you know, communicating, but he was with like some I guess some girl and um the girl I don't know her, her name or whatever the case may be, but you know, she was cute, whatever, so I'm like he probably networking, whatever. Wrong answer. So boom. Come on, laptop. But yeah, so ended up. So, so I, I was like, I ain't gonna bother them. So whatever. So they, they, I ain't even. I didn't even communicate with. I actually did text him. I was like, I'm here. I see you. Um, you know, and I see him, but I see him, see him. So I'm looking at him, seeing if he's gonna check his phone or not. So I see him. I don't see him check his phone at all. So we just like fuck it. We just paid to get in and. You know, went straight to the bar like we like we do. Um, we get our drinks, we vibing, whatever. I see some other people, 
that I saw at the bar, drinks was bought for us. We came in classy, you know. I actually saw another TikToker in there and we started communicating. Yep. Shout out to her. If she watched my video, she knows who she is. Yeah, she real. I respect her. And I didn't know she stayed in North Carolina. Like, that is crazy. I didn't even know she stayed in North Carolina. But that's off topic. So, the the thing was... um. Okay, so after we saw the TikTok or whatever, this is like maybe an hour and a half go by. We chilling. You know, we get drinks after drinks. People buying us drinks. We having a good time. Um, you know, it's packed in there. Yes, we know we're aware of COVID, but it was packed in there. And I think me and my girls was the only ones that had on masks. But, of course, we ended up taking ours off. Um yeah, so after that, I didn't see, I still haven't seen him. We went, we didn't go. He had out, they had outside seating. So I'm thinking that this is his actual club. Like, it's, this is his place. And I'm thinking he's DJing, you know, whatever the case may be. He wasn't DJing. So that was, I guess that was red flag, red, red flag of the night. One. Well, actually, two. Yeah, because he never checked his phone. So then, boom, fast forward, fast forward. Um, I see him and I see him walk in. I see him walk in and he walks to the bar with the same girl, with the same girl. And um, he sits at the bar and I tap him as I was walking by to go to the bathroom and I just waved. And now that I had, I had to use the bathroom. So I went to the bathroom, he waved back, then that was it. Literally came out the bathroom. We started vibing some more like with the, with the other people that was buying us drinks like we really won't whatever so boom after that I Saw him recording the crowd and he put the camera directly on me and I just tried to be like Because for one you 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 record me being at your event, but you don't acknowledge that I'm there and you actually wanted us to be there so that was whatever so I try to let it go try to let it go then after that still wasn't acknowledging didn't say hey didn't say how you doing thank you for coming or nothing he didn't say none of that stuff nothing so we left fast forward the my girls we was walking of course we see the same dudes that was trying to buy his dreams it was whole nother thing but this is a story talking about him not our night um so we left um the night went on fast forward to maybe the next time i saw him i was like you sure did act funny at the club or the little lounge and i was like what do you mean what do you mean yeah you know exactly what i mean like i saw you one t i saw you one good time and then i saw you a couple times doing your little back and forths and you you recorded me, but you did not. You failed to speak. He was like, "Oh, I I, I apologize. I was networking. I was communicating." Da, da, da. And I was okay. I respect it. I respect it. But you you the the whole time you was recording on your phone, you saw a message. <laughs> you can't tell me you didn't because you did. And he was like, "Yeah." Um, I even take I even wrote him on Instagram, and I saw him seeing it. So that's how I know he was on his phone. Y'all should have left that situation alone right then and there. So after that, he was like, you know, I apologize, or da whatever. So time went on. I let it go. I let it go. Then, you know how dudes do. A few days later, oh, when I'm going to take you out? When I'm going to do this? When I'm going to do that? Oh, we going to this Mexican spot. I'm going to take you to go eat, go get some margaritas, or da da Because this stage in my life, I'm going to go. Hey, There's nothing wrong with just going to dinner. So, wait on that. That slowly did not happen. And uh, then I stopped. I low-key I low stopped. Slowly, not withdrawing myself completely, but as far as communicating, I stopped a little bit. Because it's like, what are we really doing here? Because clearly nothing is happening. We literally, 
I'm not even gonna say that. Like literally, we cross, we run in the same circles for our careers. Every other day, I see this. I, I see him. He see me. So there's like I don't I don't get it. So then it came down to him trying to talk to me and was like, you know what? I feel like you don't want to get to know me like I like I want to get to know you. And I said, well, how was that? You don't text me no more. You don't you don't do the things. You don't you don't call me. You don't do this. You don't do that. And I was just like, well, two a phone works two ways. And I feel like if I don't get the same energy that I'm giving you, I withdraw. I withdraw. So you're telling me. And not only did we have this conversation once, but he called he he tried to talk to me about this situation twice. I guess I guess he was trying to tell me to communicate better twice. So I was like, let me stop playing actually, you know, put put it everything behind me and try to do better. When I tell y'all, he had me all the way up. Yeah, so I I was doing better. I was calling him. I was texting him. I can literally run down the messages, and it'll be blue, 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 blue. <laughs> he don't respond at all. Then on Instagram, seen, seen, seen. He don't respond. So I'm like, so you did all this to get me to look like I'm begging for your attention. That's basically what I feel like that it is. And I'm not doing that. I'm sorry. I'm not doing it. Don't care how you feel about it. It is what it is. It is what it is. So I told him. I was, and, I, and after that came about, I stopped completely. I just stopped. Whatever the case may be, I stopped. So then... One day, like I said, we see each other. We're in the same. So this one time that he seen me, he was coming from the bathroom. I was going down the hall about to go out the door. Hey, I didn't know you was here today. Da, da, da. That's so rude. Anyways, they're, they're doing something to the ceiling. I don't know. So... He was like, I don't know you was here today. And I was like, mm, yeah, I'm always here. And it's been January. I'm always here literally because I got stuff to accomplish. And he was like, it's nice seeing you. Though. I said, well, if you answer a text message or a call. And I kept walking. I didn't want to stop. I didn't. Well, if you answer a text message or a call and not leave me hanging, you would see. And you would actually, you know, whatever. I was I was really not caring at this. Oh, you got you got me. Mm -hmm. You, you could have got the submissive girl. You could have got the girl that was open to get to know you to to try to pursue something. But you want to give ass to kiss? Oh, baby, I can give mine. Simple as that. Simple as that. And I'm gonna say that again. So yeah. So. I basically explained to him like this saying like so, like you did this you tell me more than once to try to communicate better and try to do this and try to do that and be patient with you and do all this other stuff but when I start doing it and put my pride aside oh you want to act a whole different way why do dudes do that I don't understand I don't understand at all I really don't I really don't. And this wasn't recent. This was like a few weeks ago. Whatever. Well, that is recent. Okay, whatever. But not understanding. Not understanding at all. So that happened. I told him. And then he hits me up the next day and was like, where did I leave you hanging? I said, scroll up. You can clearly see all the messages you left me on scene, sir. Yeah. Then I was like, well, check your text messages, too. You don't respond. Oh. Oh, I do apologize. Um, I'll be, I be really trying to get to the money. I'll be really busy. Like, I'll be getting so caught up in work and stuff. Like, I do apologize. Okay, cool. Be happy. I didn't want to talk about it no more. He was like, but I do wish you the best of luck. I wish you the best of luck, too, P. I really do. 
I really do. I wish no bad on anybody. If that's what you're driven to do, do not try to pursue somebody, please. Especially if they're on the same wave you are, trying to be focused. Do not distract them. That's the bottom line, period, point blank. But that's the end of the story time. Um, just know that I'm still focused. That's exactly why I'm still single to this day. Because nobody's going to knock me off. And even if I try to even have a friend or whatever the case may be, they need to have an understanding of where I am in my, in my life. It is what it is, pure point blank. But like, comment, and subscribe to this channel for more story times. Comment down below. Follow me on Instagram. You see it right there or you see it down there. <laughs> Love y'all. Yeah. Please tell me that I can't, that I won't, that I fail.